It is Commonwealth Picker and we are on our way to do some yard sailing and today I'm actually going to meet up with somebody. Um, he's a former student of mine. He's now in college and uh, he wanted to uh, get going on eBay so he doesn't have to have a job that ties him down to a particular schedule when he's in college. And So he asked me if I'd uh, help him out a little bit and of course I said I would. Good morning. Morning. You mind if we come in? Yeah, good morning, guys. All right. Hey, good morning, guys. Good morning. How are y'all doing? Good. How good, you good, doing? good. So you got uh, a bunch of stuff for sale here. Yeah, tell Just... us if you're looking for anything in particular. We can steer you to Oh, uh, well, video games, jewelry. Oh, no, we don't Look at that. all this baseball stuff here. Yep. Holy moly. How much you got on all your gloves and... Thanks, but you, you're the oh. expert on What you got? I'm not really sure. I mean, give, you know, give, me a, give me a price or something because, well, you know, some of these gloves are like 200 bucks. Well, so, you know, <laughs> I can tell. I was a baseball coach forever. Yeah, these these aren't 200 bucks. Oh, we had loads of them. Our son was a, um, a catcher. Oh, yeah. And those catcher mitts went right away, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. How about this pitching machine? What do you got on that? Uh, 30 bucks. Is it working? Oh, yeah. It's here's working? A, a yeah, it works real good. We don't have, here's a, a wire, honey. You want to show them? Anything on these shelves is a shack attack. How about Air this puzzle? puzzle? Yeah. Alright, I'll make a little pile if you don't mind. Digimon. Find anything there, Daniel? You know, I left my phone in the car. I might need to go grab that. How about these cars? Um, what if I made you an offer for the whole, or what, what if you tell me a price for the whole box of cars? Which one? That box right these there? right here. Yeah. I got a little boy. He might like them. Yeah. I got some places I might be able to mm -hmm. sell some. For me, a price. Um, I think there's about 100 cars in here. I'm not sure. Hmm. I doubt there's a hundred of them. You think there's a hundred of them? Can we count them? <laughs> if you want to. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I, I mean, I'll I'm offer you twenty bucks for the for the box. I'll uh, I'll tell you what. I'll sell you these for fifty cents a piece. For the beach, do you have kids? Uh, yeah, I got kids for sure. Daniel, I want you to come here. Look at something. Look at this. Uh, does this work? The cash register. Mm -hmm. You know what? Yeah. Here's the thing. Four, three, five, DX. Mm-hmm. Um, I think it has a key. It does. It does. But All how, right. But how it works, man, I can't tell you. I, I don't want to tell you. Yeah. Never did it. You might be able to go online. This generation book. can go online and get the book. <laughs> tell me again what you're offering for all these cards. 20 bucks. How much? 20 bucks. Did you go 25? I will certainly think about it. All right. We put them away. Uh, to give them for Christmas to all mm -hmm. the family, but I guess we forgot we have them. Yeah. All right, well, I'll put them in my pile over here. I'll probably end up getting them. Do a quarter of baseball. Yep. Do you have a bag by any yep. chance? Mm -hmm. One, two, three, five. Give me a dollar and a quarter for all of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
six. I think that'll have to do. Six. Yep. I'll, uh, I'm still making a pile out there, so. Oh, gosh, you are. <laughs> Assuming I can get a, bun a, a slight discount with a bundle here. You need to download, you need to download the, uh, you bet. You bet. Yeah, yeah. ASAP. You got it. Find any of these though. Okay. Look them up on my phone. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, if they anything. have a barcode, you can scan them in. Oh, you can scan a barcode. Just do like this. You hit this little camera. For those prices, yeah. Yeah. well, that one's not bad. Flip it over. Let me see what it is. So that's a Chevy. Such a generic barcode show. It shows all the different types. Right. So I'm saying no. There's probably not any money in it. That's all right. I have sixty-three dollars worth of stuff. Fifty-five dollars. You gotta ask the man. <laughs> okay. I, I will. I will. Oh, you need one of these. You need one of those. Oh yeah. For sure. We got one at home. All right. I'll buy it. I'll buy it. Here you go. Yeah. Come with picker. <laughs> How you doing, man? You're you. hilarious. I follow you. I follow you. I just found that you is too funny. What's your name? Kevin Struber. You leave a comment for me, but here, let me leave you my card. Too, too funny. Yeah, because I started on. I, I just found you the other day. I watched your thing the other night about the, um, about the, um, jewelry. Jewelry thing. So, hey, I was relieved that you already you comment in my email. We'll talk. You we'll get already, together sometime. You've already, you've already got all good stuff. <laughs> not this. Oh, that's never true. That's <laughs> never true. It's not showing up. Yeah, all right, so 60 bucks. We'll take this plate again and see what happens. Um, Not showing up? Mm -mm. Okay. All right. Are you guys good? Yes, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Do you mind putting that in the back of my truck? Did you end up getting that? Uh, did you end up getting that? Uh, the cash register? Yeah, I got the cash Wait. register and the uh, car actually. Nice. Alright, so the first yard sale was pretty good. Hot prices were a little too high, but we did find a few odds and ends that we're going to use at the uh, antique booth. I did find an item either we're going to use for ourselves for that pitching machine um, for Turner as he grows up or Jacob. And then uh, uh, if not, if we don't like it, we'll take it to play it against sports and we'll double our money pretty quick, I think. Uh, we can also sell it on eBay. Um, the box full of cars, vintage looking, uh, you know, um, Hot Wheels, NASCAR-ish cars um, are going to sell very well in the booth and probably triple our money in the booth on those. Pay 25 for that whole box. It's probably about 30 cents a piece, but we'll have to figure that out when we get home. I did fail as a teacher because I did not make sure that Daniel had an eBay app loaded on his phone, so uh, apologize for that. And... Um, he did have a couple things I think we'll make some money on. Off the catcher's gloves. I knew you would. He's like, yeah, they already sold those catcher's gloves. I'm like, yeah, I know who bought them. <laughs> but you left a couple. You left uh, uh, You left some baseballs for me I got for a quarter apiece, so thank you. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I mean, they had a few bags. They had a few balls, but they were all, they weren't any good. There's a few that weren't too bad. They might have pulled them back out of yeah, something, but. Got, uh, I don't really remember them having a big bag of mm -hmm. balls. It wasn't big. There was like five or six of them is all there was. It was no big deal. How about that pitching machine? You left that. Is it, do they not Do they not buy those over there? He wanted 50 bucks for it. Uh-huh. And I, there was no way I was going to make any money for play it again. Well, he reduced it to 30 and I got it today for 25 Oh, you did? Yep. Okay. Um, I probably am going to keep it, though, for my kid. Mary Kay. All your Liberty stuff on um, eBay. eBay. Mm-hmm. Do you sell it some of it over there to those guys? Well, I mean, I know, but I've come across. Uh, I got a pretty good little pile of it. Right. Some pretty decent stuff, and I'm, you know, I'm trying to decide what the best way is to get rid of it. Um. Well, you could always sell it to me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah well, you... 
Oh man, I, I actually had a huge haul of it the other day. I paid a hundred dollars and I took like 40 oh, Liberty things. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. the dude over there off of... Um, yep. Yep. Because yeah, I because um, I went there. I said I'm I can like, outfit like, my whole I'm family. Like, you want some liberty stuff? She's like, it's all gone. Yeah, had, exactly. <laughs> She's like, some guy came early and he got it all. <laughs> Would you make a deal on this whole bag? Sure. Um. Here, I'll just, I'm gonna, um how does uh? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten. How does uh? Take a look. Like, fifteen bucks. Yeah. That sound good. Yep. All right, we'll do that. What you finding, Daniel? Nerf gun reader, five bucks. They want five bucks? Ooh, yeah, that's it, dude. Oh yeah, definitely, 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 definitely. I mean, that's a definite win. Look at that. Do you have a date? Can you find a date on it? See if I can find a date. Switching by picture, there's one for thirty and one for five. How did you look it up, though? That's my point. Is this a mini? Oh, you just looked up the picture. That's not it actually. It's not vintage because that's 95, so I'm saying. Actually, wait, that looks about See if we right. can find a date on it. I'm not seeing a date on it. It's tough to tell if that's vintage or not, to be honest with you, but you go for it? normally they have a date. No, for 25 cents you just buy it. Yes. Figure it out later. Actually throw it in, right? So five bucks if you let me have this. Does that make sense? Yeah, that's a nice one. What is that? That is that carrier whatever you call it. Is it for Star Wars 2? Yeah, it looks like it. Got missing missiles, but that doesn't matter. If the age is right. I don't know why you can't find dates on these things. Maybe you can ask her and say, hey, is this a old one? Or maybe maybe just lot the whole thing together. She'll probably do it. And then you then you go figure it out, right? Right. That's going to be a winner for you. That's going to be good. How much did you stop finding comps? I found that for about 30. Sold. Mm -hmm. 30 okay. Sold it for 30. Yeah, and you can piece it out. So that's a definite winner. And there's plus also, there's, this stuff isn't yeah. even like part of it, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah. See, the clips, and you can sell that stuff separate. So that's a good buy for sure. Definitely. I'm going to take some uh, free Absolutely. Liberty sunglasses. Is that all right with you? And my daughter might might love that terrible-looking necklace. So we'll get that one, too. Uh, that Minecraft sword. Huh? Did you already grab that Minecraft No, sir. You can have it. My son would love it. All right, man. Have a good one. Hey. All right, man. You going to hit the tree of life? Yeah, I'm going to go right now. So beat me there. You got to look up that show right there. How much you owe? You got $2 on this? Yeah. All right. Dana, you you need this? I no, think I got one. no, I think you need it. <laughs> I think you need it. Give her an extra two bucks. Give her an extra two bucks for that. <laughs> hey man, what's going on, brother? Ain't no good. <laughs> I am. I won't take all the sporting goods. I promise. I won't. I leave them for you most of the time unless it's too good. All right, this one's a lot better. So Daniel kicked butt on this one. Uh, got a, a beautiful, uh, I think it's a Vulcan. It's a big setup Nerf gun. Should make him some good money, especially as Christmas comes. He got some, sorry, <laughs> I don't get an accident. Got some uh, Star Wars stuff. Looks vintage, I'm not sure it is. Either way, it was so cheap, it doesn't matter. Minecraft sword. Um, and then the, the uh, Swiss bag, um, rolling bag, perfect time to sell those. Not huge money, but definitely something he can sell pretty quick and get some feedback on. So, all right. Yeah. Big pocket, little pocket. Big pocket. Let's see if there's a blue bag in there. Yep. All right, perfect. All right. Zip it back up. <laughs> That's my gift to you. <laughs> You'll see why later. Just uh, hold on to it. Shipping and whatnot. I use it all the time. Most of the rest are just. Hmm. Okay, well that's $14.99, right? Plus shipping. So you probably sell it for $15 plus shipping. 
and you're gonna probably pay two dollars. It's about a ten, it's about eleven dollar profit if you want to do it. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah, I would. See if you can get it for two bucks. Hmm. Yep. What do you usually do? Just look for name brands, or? Yeah, I mean they got Vans over there. Did you see those? Those Vans aren't bad. I mean Nikes, Vans. I mean it just depends. I mean there's all kinds of names out there. You just got to start looking them up. You see something you think is interesting, you just grab it. He was probably too much money for what he had, money. Yeah, if you okay. offered me like a buck for the Pokemon, so, I would have done that. So he's a pro, okay? You can tell by what he's selling that he's a reseller, right? That makes so it's sense. pretty hard to find those, get, find the profit there. So you, you don't necessarily stay away from the pros. I couldn't get a thing on that Chia Pet. I wonder how much they are. How much you? How much on the Chia Pets? Two dollars? Looking for a stroller and I found one. She ten dollars. Five. Five. He done come down the back or the what? Hmm. I think I'll get that for Terry. Uh -uh. Oh no, no, no. Spider Man. Yeah, he loves Spider Man. I don't think there's any resale value in it, but not SpongeBob pen though? Oh, he likes SpongeBob. How about two for three and I'll take both of them? That sound good? Alright. I just seen Tia. She said, Your mom here somewhere. I said, Lord, well, Thank you. How much you want on your little book here? How about a quarter? Okay. That sound good? Did you want a bag? No, I don't need a bag. Thank you. Thank you. How much on the Tupperware? Dollar. Alright, I'm gonna make a little pile here, I think. Three bucks. Do you want me to get you a bag? That would be it. Well, yeah, sure, I'll take a bag. There you are. God, I'm looking for it. Okay, so there's three of those, two books. How about five bucks for the whole lot of it? Sure. Does that sound good? That sounds good. All right. <clears throat> Tang. A little guest watch. Nickelodeon. Neither one work. Need batteries. Mini Mouse, 50 cents each, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I can do that. Give me change. Give change. Here, I'll pay for it for him. This one's on me. I can handle 50 cents. Appreciate it. Buzz Lightyear. That's missing the cap on it, though, unfortunately. Here, I'll give you a dollar fifty. Thank you. Thank you. You have a nice day. You too. Thank you. A well, little trick is to ask them first and if their prices are too much, then don't bother looking it up. Right. This is really small. What's that one? Is it good? I don't know. You just asked about a cookbook, so I figured maybe. I don't know if it is or not. Probably not. <laughs> you got to check out the, uh, the the booth ones. We did an antique booth. You might have fun doing that. We've had a blast. Yeah. So, yeah. at any rate. When is that um, sale in um, Hillsville? Smith, Smith oh, Smith Mountain. Mountain. Oh, Joy's Junk? Yes. Okay, so I it's usually no the first week of June. 
June. You gotta go. Okay. The prices aren't amazing, but okay. there's so much stuff that you're bound to find something good. Yeah. So, any rate. Are there any good ones coming up? Um, you know, Hillsville is uh, the end of the month, but you know. Thank you. You're very welcome. Oh, you have a new yeah, one. Man. Okay. Yeah. What's happening, Thanks. man? How are you? I'm doing good. How are you doing? I'm good. What are you doing out here, man? You're always out here. I'm always out here. You're, you're, are out here you a reseller? Or you just like to collect I just stuff? Collect stuff. Funny. Yeah. Funny. Here, I'm going to give you something. You'll laugh at me if you like to collect stuff. I got a YouTube channel about you. Check, oh, cool. check me out. I'll do that. Leave a comment, man. <laughs> <laughs> what in the world is this thing? It's uh, one of Leonardo da Vinci's uh, inventions. A little game? Yeah, one of his little games. You, uh, I heard you say you get storage auctions. You sell online as well? I don't do it anymore. No? So you just do yeah, flea market I've stuff? I've got uh, so much stuff from the previous auctions that I haven't needed to do it. And you're anymore. just getting rid of it? I got 17 totes of jeans at the house. I bring <laughs> two at a time. It's I hear you. a dollar a pair. Well, hey, I'm going to give you this card. If you ever start doing it again, give me a call. Maybe we can work together on something. If you need uh, to unload, I do sell online, so yeah. let me know. Are you kidding me? How much on your U.S. mail sign? Two bucks. Two bucks. I'll do it. I like it. Um, hey, I appreciate your business. You have a good one. Thank you. Hey, but, thank uh, you. You I might be on camera. Business. I don't know. You might be. On, would you uh, be all right if I put you on my YouTube? I don't know. <laughs> you're don't you're an interesting guy. That's yeah, all. Yeah, I don't care. If you <laughs> all right. Hey, well, good luck to you. Hey, thank thank you. Me. Appreciate it. You too. Now that is pretty cool. I was thinking about that one. Is it going to be worth anything? Or is that just yeah, cheap? yeah. No, it'll, it'll, it'll sell in my booth for sure. It'll probably sell on eBay. Is my guess. Frequent stops, three-sided. Pretty cool. I mean, how often do you come across something like that? Probably not very often. I like them. I like them a lot. What's this stuff here? Mudville, huh? Funny. All right. So old school Carolina League baseballs. Bunches of them. These will go for about $10 a piece. Really? Yeah, Carolina League balls do. Which, you know, after shipping and whatever, you, you know, it's $6. So if you're getting for a buck, you're making five bucks a piece. But there's a bunch, right? So we'll right. see if the price is right. How much are you asking on the baseballs and this ring right here? And you got a stapler up there and the knife thing. <laughs> there, I gave you a bunch. Whoops, a dollar for these each. Yeah. Okay. How about these? How about how about uh, the baseballs? Uh, the well, we were giving those out to the kids. Oh my goodness. The, we, my brother was on the uh, booster club for. Okay. Cat, so. Okay. You're not going. You, you won't sell them. Um. I mean, I got kids. <laughs> uh, um. How about fifty cents a piece, and I'll take a uh, bunch of them. Not good? Yeah. Okay, we'll do that. Bat just fell out of this thing. Huh? Bat just fell out of this thing. I think it's broken. Mm, probably not, actually. It's probably not broken, is my guess. Mm. <laughs> I wonder how much that goes for. Yeah, I think it just sticks in there. Look at that. The guy's Oh, yeah, you're right. It has a little knock Yeah, there. I think this is probably what it does. All right, so Frank. Who is that? Frank Robinson. I can't say I've ever heard of him, but I'm not much of a baseball guy. <laughs> He's a uh, Hall of Famer. Ask him how much they want for it. How much you want for the Frank Robinson? $2. Goes for about 20, 25 for shipping. You want it? If not, I'll take it. It gets the corners. Thank you. How much on your little sprinkler? $2. I don't know why I like it. I just do. I just like it. I don't know why. My wife would love that. 
I'm glad she's not here because she'd probably make me buy it. Well, I think I'm going to pass for now, but I might come swing by before I leave. All right, thank you. They'll be there for you. All right. That's a good hat, 99. Mm -hmm. I'll take that. You can grab that. That's a good one. That'll go. Not big money, but... The same hat for anywhere from, from 30, from 20 to 60. Really? There's no difference between the ones at 20 and the ones at 60. Yeah, it's it's oftentimes about the keywords and the listings. Yeah, it was the one that this mm -hmm. vintage mm -hmm. that we sell for 60. And a good way to save hello, space hello. is you put... Hello. How are you? Is if you put uh, in the title instead of writing vintage, because you want to put all the cram all the good keywords you can cram in there, mm -hmm. you put VTG and it'll save you the letters. And if somebody types in vintage, it'll still come up. Gotcha. Okay. Which is a good way to save space. But a lot, of, a lot of times, go to the very, the one that sold for the most in sold listings, and steal their listing. So right. you go there and they've already got good keywords, and then maybe kind of tweak it a little bit um to fit what you want but keywords are really really key <laughs> there's a fanny pack right there brother but dang on three dollars oh you're not too too much of a man to wear a fanny pack huh no no no, no. it's useful with all the junk we're gonna carry around i'd be carrying around three dollars for that fanny pack though that's a little steep a little steep i like it but it's steep especially with no name brand on it Believe it or not, fanny packs sell old ones. I've sold some fanny packs for $25. Really? Mm-hmm. The old ones. These are sweet chairs right there. Need the Lost and Found sisters to come check these chairs out. How you doing? How much did you have on your crates? I think seven. Seven on them? I'll tell you what, I'll buy all four of them for five bucks a piece. 20 bucks, take them all. I'm like, you gotta give me a bulk discount. All right. All right, that sounds like a deal. Yeah, yeah. You just, just tell him he sold them for what you're at. He'll never know. He'll never know. <laughs> That's what I do with my wife. I come home and I tell her, I was like, oh, I only spent 20 bucks. And then I hide all the stuff I bought in the shed. <laughs> So she doesn't get mad at me, you know. She doesn't go to the shed and <laughs> I'm sure she does. There you go. Okay. Thank you so much. Y'all have a wonderful day. All right. Michael going home? Michelangelo, yeah. And my kid loves the Ninja Turtle, so we'll get him. Yeah. No, I'm kidding. I, I teach history, so I'll put it oh, in my classroom. That's great. Well, I'm so. glad somebody's gonna enjoy it. Thank right. you. Thank you so much. Top five high. No bueno. All right, y'all, we're headed to another yard sale or two uh, today before we part ways. But uh, we've been doing pretty good. Tree of Life yard sale. We found a few good things. I found a bunch of stuff to sell in the uh, booth. Um, those baseballs, some Lynchburg uh, Hillcat items. My guess is that, that those items are probably $10 to $15 items each profit. And the baseballs will probably end up making about uh, 50 bucks for me, so I'm pretty happy with that. Daniel, anything you find there that you liked? Yeah, I got a nice 1999 uh, Spurs Championship hat for about a buck. All right, I so I got them looking 50. for the vintage hats already, so I've already accomplished goal number 